Hey everybody, welcome back to a new episode of the Let's Play Majora's Mask. The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, that is. In the last episode, we finally got the stray fairies back to the Great Fairy. We got the frogs, piece of heart, and we have put in water in here and saw a very big side quest. Anyway, the, the door is locked. Da, 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 da. Can you come out and play again? Because seriously, I want to know what's, what you're hiding there. I want to go inside. You unlock the door, so... Go search for them blast! So she's stepping outside and she's going to try to check out what that blast was. So you want to stay here for just a couple of secs and then we're just going to sneak inside. Okay, now, a small warning, this can be scary, but it's also the most beautiful scene. Well, that's, well, no, not the most beautiful scene, but still this is a very, I think it's a very good scene. Just watch. What have I been doing this whole time? You haven't been doing anything! You had a bad dream! You were just having a little nightmare! Oh, Pamela! Okay, we see a mask here, so... <coughs> Excuse me for that cough. We got the Gipto's mask. The mask was once the hideous face of Pamela's father. This mask looks so real that even a Gipto would mistake you as one of their own. So... Isn't that touchy? Okay, just give me a small sec. You didn't have any audio commentary there. Sorry, my mic was muted. <laughs> well, anyway, uh, yeah, I will speak that in later in, so don't worry about that. But anyway, we have the Gipto's mask, and like I said, that's a new collection to our masks. And with that, we can go to a new area. Great. So, yeah, this is going a little bit faster. Um, we are going to check out this well over here. But before we're going inside of that well, I really recommend for wearing the Gibdos mask. So, let's go down the hole. It's the same thing actually as the bottom of the well, if I'm not mistaken. It looks the same way anyway, so... It looks like the bottom of the well in the Ocarina of Time, let's put it that way, so... Okay, well anyway, you will have some Gibdos standing here. Is, is your name a Gibdo? I want to check it out. Tattle, say something. Say it! Okay, well, I think it's Gibdo. I'm just going to call him Gibdo, so... Um, if anyone's saying we want to open this one first, and they will be like... <laughs> Leave it! Leave it! Leave me something blue that bestows health! Whoa, seriously! You are really going to have my most expensive item that I already bought! You really want to have that already? Sheesh, well, here you have it. it Cost 100 rubies, you bitch! Ah... This, this, I bear you no remorse. And they will just disappear and open the door. <coughs> ah, excuse me. So anyway, that's basically what we're going to do here. Now, um, right over here, we can have some flame arrows. Uh, yeah, flame. And if I'm not mistaken, this one contains fish. And we're really going to need some fish here, so... 
You got a fish! And I'm not gonna say that one reference that is lying on my tongue right now. Ah, damn you, Tim! Damn you now! This LP is awesome. Anyway, we need two of those, if I'm not mistaken. So... Um, I'm just going to take the shortest route uh, throughout this dungeon. Uh, well, mini dungeon, actually. It's not really a dungeon. Um, there is a... Uh, yeah, how do you say that? It, there is a fairy fountain right in the map, right in... If I'm not mistaken, the upper corner. Uh, yeah, right straight to the north. So... Um, there is also a big boat that we're going to encounter later on. So... Uh, I'm not going... Yeah, the big boat we're going to see that, but the other thing... Nah. Don't feel like it. This way is also not. Well, wait. For, I think that was hot spring water right over there that we're going to need. Leave it. Yeah, they're all going to say the same thing. Deliciously fresh. Well, I first we caught one, so if you want to have something deliciously fresh, you can have a fish. Okay. Now let's open this way. And there's the hot spring water that I was talking about, and. Here you can catch more fish if you want, but I really do not want that, and I'm just going to ignore you. Okay, um... That hand can give you a lot of trouble, so I'm just going to throw a bomb at it. And I miss. Damn it. I need 10 more bombs, so I can make another mistake out of that. Okay, hand is destroyed, cool. Because now we have to do something a little timed, because, you know, hot spring water can... Yeah, lo lo lose his hotness by time, so you only have... If I'm not mistaken, you have two minutes before it's going to cool down, so... Yeah, we have to hurry a little bit, so... Okay, now let's go this way... Do, 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 do. If I'm not mistaken, that one wants to have a big bow that we do not have right now. So, can you please go up? Owie... I'm not a big fan of this place, seriously. This this place, when I was young and I played this game for the first time, this place gave me the creep, seriously. Okay, what do you want? Leave it, leave it. Leave me something delicious to jump on. Something that sprouts when it's watered. Oh, yeah. And um, like I said, you really want to have five Deku... Well, magic beans, sorry, not Dekus, but magic beans. You really want to have five of those. Uh, with you, so... Ah, oh, this is a baby, no remorse. Awesome sauce. Okay, we still have to... Time! No, do not freeze me, you stupid bat! Ignoring you. This is what they do. Ignoring you. Uh, okay, now we have to talk to this dude. What do you want? Leave me something that makes a blinding flash, preferably 10 of them. Okay, well, I bought this one just in the uh, store where you also can get a big... Yeah, the big uh, power keg, so... There's also a room where you can farm for these in this dungeon, but I really do not feel like going that way now, so... Anyway, if you want to go with the way you have to get the hot water, you have to talk to this dude, and he will be like... Leave me something warm that can melt ice and quartz over spirits. And he just wants to have that hot spring water. Nice thing to know. Ah, this, this, I bet you know one more. Shut up and piss off. Okay, now I have to do spin it. I got hit in the cutscene. Great, typically. Okay, well, anyway, I need magic. Uh, what was behind this anyways? Oh, uh, here you can get milk too, so... You really do not need to have milk in the beginning already. Oh, I thought that I needed that, but... Apparently not. Uh, do I need something small and creepy? Because I thought it was behind here as well, no? Only milk? Are you serious? Oh, huh. okay. Cool. No problem. So I'm just going to talk to this dude. And he's going to be, I want to have something small and creepy if I'm not mistaken. Leave me ten refresh. Oh yeah, he wants to have ten bombs, like I said. Okay, now, uh, you want to have uh, you want to have blast? You want to have professing blast? Well, here you go. Or do you want to have one powder keg, bitch? Okay, well, anyway. If we go in here... This is the place where you can get... <clears throat> a very early... Big Poe. Um, there are... As I know... 
there are only two big bows in this game. Uh, one is on the third day in the graveyard uh, with Dan Pei. And this is the second one. So, did I just hit you while you were thro going through a wall? Apparently I did. Okay, what spins around comes around and then I'm going to shoot you with an arrow because I can. Okay, you're going to be appear right behind me again. I'm gonna lock onto you and that's what we're going to do. Or you're gonna hit me with that. Damn you. I hate you. Well, anyway, um... My experience on Skyward Sword. Well, I just finished up two dungeons right now and I'm close to the third dungeon. And... Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh god. I'm really afraid of beating the game. <laughs> I know, and I really do not want to see anything in the core in the in the um cuts uh, well in the cutscene. In the comments about that game because I really do not wanna have spoilers. My buddy Final Fantasy game, also known as Marco, is uh like, hey dude, I'm already in that in that dungeon. I really do not want to know, gee, seriously. Don't spoil how many dungeons there are. Don't spoil what the bosses are like. Just don't spoil anything. If everybody wants to have their fun with the game, so... Uh, why do I have to keep saying that to everybody? I, I'm... I want to have my own experience with the game. And so far, I like the game very much. And I'm really getting sick and tired of that keys. Well, they are not really called keys in this game, but oh well, who gives a shit? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I wanted to go that other way. I wanted to go this way, right over. Wait a minute, do you have. Piss off! Do not freeze me! Don't be an asshole! No, there's no small and creepy things here. Well, there's Deku Stick. <laughs> I needed those. Thank you. Okay, well, what do you want? Because I thought that I had to put this one. Leave it, leave it. Leave me something deliciously fresh. You also want to have a fish? Well, that's a good thing that I have two fish. Yay. Yeah, no remorse. Blah, blah, blah. Great. Okay, now we're getting close to the end of this because this is really getting on my nerves. Uh, this is the place where you can farm for Deku Seeds, right here. This is the place where I was talking about. I do not need Deku Seeds right now, but, well, just going to show off like, uh, hey, here you can get some Deku Seeds. So, just that you know. Okay, now we want to go this way. And there are pots here. Why are there pots here? Oh, hi! I don't ever think you cannot put those in a bottle. Piss off! Okay, I'm just going this way. What do you want? Dude? Leave it! Leave me a ghost, a big one at that. Well, we got one! <laughs> he also hit me, but who cares? Okay, well, we have a big ghost. Here you have. Here you have your big ghost. And this is painful because otherwise I could sell it for 200 rubies and that's two blue potions, so really that's not funny. I really thought that we needed something small and creepy. Oh, hi. I knew that you would come, you bastard! I'll take you with a red ruby. Okay, do not hit me! Thank you. Okay, this is the last one if I'm not mistaken and he wants milk. Oh, leave me something rich. Yeah, he wants milk. Awesome sauce. Know your games, mate! Know your games! Okay, well. Ah, this, this, I bear you no remorse. Well, we're getting close to the end of this episode, so... This was the last mummy that, well, yeah, Gipto, mummy, whatever you want to call it, I don't care. So, I'm just going to lit up these torches and going to thank you all for watching. So, first of all, if you didn't have to subscribe to me yet, if you want to do that, you can do that by clicking on the subscribe button and you will be updated for more videos. Second of all, if you have any questions about this episode, you can put it in the comment section. Don't spoil about Skyward Sword. It will make me mad! And I'm going to make you mad because I'm not going to show you what's inside this uh, chest right now. I'm just going to show you uh, me walking into the screen. And <laughs> yeah, you know the drill. So thank you all for watching this Zelda Blade 1 and I'm going to sign off. Bye now!